All right, so I accidentally recorded the first bit in like a 60 second clip. But essentially, um, I'm unboxing the second slingshot. As you can see, it's got these nubs, like they pop out and then they loop back around. And the last time I pulled it back, it tried to slap me. Let's see what happens. Okay, it looks like this one's actually holding. Oh, but you can see they pulled back significantly. So I'm thinking I might just pull them out and do like what I did with the other one and tie them. Like, that's just not very secure. And I feel like if you're shooting fucking arrows, there's gonna be significant amounts of pullback. So like, why wouldn't you just make sure it's in there? But, yeah. Um, I'm trying to get this like tied off before I go to game night. Essentially, it's like with the trivia people, and they, it's like 15 people all together, and they set up like four different stations at their place, and they've got like four different board games going on at a time, but they're not like normal conventional board games. They're like weird board games, like the shit you only find in underground message boards. It's like, <laughs> it's kind of crazy. So that is the plan, game night. I have not wanted to be around new people or like a lot of people since I started exploring the socialization. But here we go. You know, it's time. It's time to get back out there. And I ended up not sleeping last night for some reason, like no reason in particular. I thought that not being on caffeine was going to solve this whole like insomnia thing, but apparently not. It's just a different level of energy while you remain just as like sleepless as before. I'm kind of brain foggy, but what can you do? Oh my God, this is gonna be harder than I thought. And like, I honestly just kind of wanted to skip it, but when I did my confirmation card for whether I should go or not, it was the, the ripple. So like, there's a reason that I have to be there. At the very least, spirit wants me to demonstrate that I'm willing to go. So socialization. But at least it's like earlier in the day, you know? It's not gonna be like till midnight. It's gonna be starting at what, like one to three o'clock, somewhere in there? Okay. It's incredibly difficult to get this to push through. Almost got it. Got it. All right. So, now that that's knotted in, one side is secure. And I'm just doing the other thing, do the same thing with the other side. It's such a weird design flaw, man. I wouldn't have thought this would be an issue. I'm kind of worried about how the rubber is going to hold up in weather also. Like, in my experience, when rubber is left out in the elements, it gets really brittle and then it breaks. And I'm not sure if this tubing is gonna be any different. So, if it gets cold or if it gets wet, what happens? I might, should I experiment with that? That's too many cards. What do you think, Spirit? Should I leave one out? It's not a yes or a no. It's the chimera. Ace of Swords. I think I probably will. I'm probably gonna leave one out there in the in the in the elements. Interesting. Well, it'll do. Slingshot number two, ready to go. 
Maybe I'll show you the tool belt. I want to get a drink first. I've been drinking like key lime sparkling water. It's got, according to the label, it's made of nothing. It's a zero across the board. Yeah, I'm not sure what the hell it's actually made of. I need to figure that out. It's sparkling water, so it's got to have water and some kind of like flavor, but I can't find anything that's actually flavoring it. But on the utility belt, we've got the arrows, and then I hooked that up that way. So, you can put it on real quick. We are ready to go hunting in the wilderness. <sighs> I'm tired. I knocked my, my thing off. Ugh. What a strange day. But I feel like it's always the weird ones where you get pushed to your limits. And you have to surpass them. So, yeah, I'm tired. Yeah, I don't feel like socializing. I'm gonna do it anyway. I'm gonna figure out if that can hold up in the weather. And I'm gonna pretend that sparkling water has caffeine. <sighs> I said I wasn't going to do any kind of reading here, but for some reason I'm shuffling the cards. Maybe we will. What do you want to talk about, Spirit? Ooh, Ace of Cups and a Seven of Swords. Nine of Wands. Baby Elephant, the Empress, and the Nine of Cups. A cup of love that is being concealed by a guarded person. That is making a decision about coming forward to this Empress. they're watching. The Empress is happy. Walking into their wish fulfillment and healing. Or, you know, even though healing is a perpetual state, they're witnessing the growth. What's holding them back? A lack of movement. Why? Protecting his peace and watching from a distance. Confirm. Wisdom and discernment. Reconfirm, please. Page of Wands. He's feeling inspired, watching, but doesn't want to move forward. Because we can see the truth coming from a mile away. Maybe. This is our gifts and our spirit guides. That would lead me to believe that that's, that's accurate. But... Intuition or secrets, alignment and discipline, they may not want to disrupt the amount of progress we're making. They don't want to throw us off track. As if they could. You know, I just think it's funny, Six of Cups, because when you hit a certain point in the road, they can't. They can't throw you off. Starting a new thing won't throw you off. 
you're going to keep on doing what you're doing for you.